In this video, I'm gonna show you how to get the RTSP URL for Axis Camera. As you can see here, I have the camera on the screen via web browser, and you can get the RTSP URL using a software, or you can also read an article like this one. Here, for example, I have the RTSP command for Axis Camera. And here you can find all the details, how to use it, RTSP, username, password, device IP address, and the rest of the command. If you visit this article, you can see the details and how to use it. And there's also a lot of variation parameters that you can use. For example, if you wanna change the resolution, the codec, you just insert the parameters here in the end. And also for fisheye cameras, disable audio, everything and there's also a list with all different cameras all access camera even old models okay but sometimes it's hard to find the command directly here or you don't even know the details on the model of the model is not listed so you can use a software to do it right so let me just show the software you can use the own device manager the link here in the description is a free software so basically, if you have OnVIF enabled on the camera, you can use OnVIF Device Manager. You turn it on, you enable the software, and you can see on the left side, Axis Camera. That's the P1365 Mark II, and it loads the information about the camera. Of course, you need to go to the camera, enable OnVIF there. I have another video showing how to enable OnVIF if you don't know how to enable on Axis Camera. Basically, get the details here via OnVIF. So when I click on live video, I get the image from the camera and the RTSP command on the bottom. So I can just copy. I don't need to copy the entire command. I can copy until media.amp, right click, copy, and I can do a test. Let's say using VLC media player. It's also a free software. You come to media, open network stream, and paste the command here. So here we go, the RTSP URL. You hit play and enter the username and password that you have on the camera or on VIF. And here we go, it's working. Okay, pretty simple. The video is coming using RTSP command or RTSP URL directly from the camera. So you can use the same RTSP URL in different softwares that you want to use to communicate with Axis Camera. Pretty simple, all right? And that's it for today. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments. See you in the next video.